December 22nd, about 11.30 in the morning. Um, this is Solar House at 101 Tispequin Street. Uh, yesterday was uh, the winter solstice. We had uh, three continuous days of pretty much off and on clouds. No heat in that house yet. And uh, those solar windows uh, are warming up right now. Um, I'll go inside and show you what the temperatures inside the house are. All right, so here's the inside of the house. Uh, once again, uh, Monday, December 22nd. I just got plowed out here. You can see some of the shadowing way out here. The, the trees very limited. Uh, so we got good full sunlight on all these. Indoor temperature 49.8, outdoor temperature 22.1. Uh, December 22nd, uh, about 11.43 in the morning. And I'm gonna shoot this solar window here with the infrared, 60.2 degrees. Uh, quarter two, uh, December 22nd. Uh, you can see a very slight shadow right here from a couple of trees, but you can see this darker shadow here. Uh, this is actually uh, the only thing that's gonna record and uh, come up and, and hit that wall at all. Uh, and that, that tree is not the tree I originally thought was an issue. You may lose me here as I come up into the sun, uh, but you can see this uh, tall walnut tree, uh, which I thought was going to be an issue, but once it lost its branches, it wasn't. It was actually this uh, pine tree in the background, which is about uh, 75 to uh, 80 feet beyond that, almost 200 feet from the house, um, that is actually going to create that shadowing. But today is uh, you know, the first full day of winter. Uh, great sunny day, a lot of snow, real cold temperatures, uh, and the uh, house is actually warming up today. Uh, just from the sun hitting those windows, those windows are warming up, and I want to show you inside and how they've warmed up from this morning of about uh, 52 degrees this morning, the water in that window was. All right, so once again, December 22nd, uh, cold outside, real windy. Uh, I'll show you the indoor outdoor temperatures in a minute. Uh, these windows are 51 degrees this morning. This is the thermal mass window filled with water. Uh, we're shooting this with an infrared thermometer right now. It's showing we're reading 70.3 uh, degrees. Uh, it's 12.54 in the afternoon. Um, that was after three days. The last three days we had no sun. Uh, right now our indoor temperature with no other heat has come up to 50.9. Uh, the outdoor temperature still remains at 25.9. Um, nice sunny day today. Windows are warming up nice. They should continue to warm the space. Uh, we haven't been running any other heat source, but uh, my body temperature is probably helping to warm the space along with those windows. So we're at the uh, winter solstice. Real cold day. After uh, three solid days of no sun, house is maintaining temperature. Alright, so that's our minimum temperature, 17.1, 49.1 inside the house. Those are the minimum temperatures that we've recorded over the last 24 hours within that system. Uh, so. Given uh, three days of no sun, those windows didn't really contribute anything to the building. It was more about a heat loss of the envelope. Um, although they do have an incredible insulation value, they look pretty good, a couple of small issues, but look at the clarity, you can see right out into the nice snow outside. See right through these windows right now, you see a little reflection right there. Um, but let's take a look out here. You can actually see right out to the neighbor's yard. This is through four inches of water, four panes of glass. Uh, you can see also, uh, again, winter solstice, we have no shadowing here. So that's your minimum temperature, 17.1 last night, 49.1 the lowest. Uh, and we've actually come up to 50.7 um, today uh, with the temperature rising up into there. Uh, all right, so it's about 3.30 on uh, Monday, December 22nd, uh, first full day of winter. Uh, outside temperature you can see here is uh, 24. Uh, the inside temperature this morning, the low was recorded at 49.1. Uh, we've come up a little over 2 degrees to 51.4. Uh, no other heat provided to this building other than our solar windows. I'll just swing around and show you here. You saw the performance earlier and the temperatures of recording uh, late in the day. Um, we had good sun. All right, so we had a cold night last night, cold day today, good sunny day. Uh, 3.30, the windows. Uh, Sun's going down, there's barely any light hitting these windows anymore. Let me show you what the temperature this window's gotten up to over the course of the day after starting at 51 degrees. Uh, you shoot that window, I don't know how well you can see this, but we're recording uh, 74.3 degrees here at 3.30 in the afternoon. 
Uh, temperature in the house has risen a couple of degrees over the course of the day. It's 51.4. No other heating here. Uh, and what you'll, I think you'll see, and we're going to check, check this back a little bit later, but uh, I think you see that as those windows cool, the temperature inside the house started to rise a little bit more. Uh, this was a good, really good test. Uh, we had three days with no sun whatsoever. Uh, cold temperatures. Uh, lowest temperature experience in the house so far today is uh, 49.1 degrees. There again, after only three full, full days with no sun and uh, temperatures well into the 20s and, and 30s uh, for high temperatures in the 30s with uh, lows down to the upper teens. So, if you want to stay the years going by, every day is getting a little bit longer now. Achieved over the course of one good sunny day starting at 51 degrees. Uh, we've had a temperature rise across this window of about uh, 25 degrees, 24, 25 degrees. Um, being able to capture and store about 60 to 70,000 BTUs of thermal energy over the course of a good sunny day, even though it was uh, never got above the uh, low to mid 20. So it's 4:30 on December 22nd. You can see the temperature dropping outside. It's now down to 20.7. The inside temperature has actually risen. And in the last hour, it's gone from 51.4 to 52.5. All right. So at 3:30, uh, these windows rose uh, to about. I think they were in the 74 to 75 degree range. Uh, an hour later now, the room's warming up and the windows are starting to cool down. So it's 4.30 in the afternoon. 70.8. 70.8 degrees. So the, the temperature's dropping in the window. What it's doing is throwing that uh, into the space. Um, so hopefully this room will continue to rise as the windows continue to cool over the next couple hours. And uh, we'll check back in an hour or so. All right, so it's now uh, 6.15, December 22nd. Uh, temperature outside is continuing to drop. It's down to 19.9. But the temperature inside the house uh, in the last, uh, well, since 4.30, so about an hour and 45 minutes has risen uh, from 52.5 uh, up to 53.2. All right, so it's a quarter past six. Temperature inside the house is uh, 53.2. Temperature outside, 19.9. Uh, this wall at 4.30 was around 70 degrees um, and was still at uh, 68 degrees. So uh, as we continue to uh, drop temperature from that wall and that window, it's uh, throwing heat into the space and the space is rising just a little bit. Um, Alright, so it's now 7.40 at night, um, December 22nd, uh, first full day of winter. You can see the room is continuing to warm up a little bit. It's kind of stabilized a little bit in the last hour or two. It's 53.4, came up another 0.2 degrees. Temperature outside is continuing to drop. It's down to 19 degrees. So it's uh, 20 minutes of 8, December uh, 22nd, and uh, you showed you the inside temperature still warm up. The windows are dropping a little bit. Uh, right now, at this time of night, they are 66.5 degrees. So uh, you can see that from the high temperature today, They've dropped nine degrees over the last four and a half hours since the sun's gone down. And they've continued to dump, dump that heat into the space and the, and the space continues to rise slowly. Uh, I think it's going to moderate right about now and then it will continue to drop off a little bit over the course of the night as these windows continue to cool. Uh, but that's it for today. Uh, I'll shoot this again tomorrow morning and show you what it does uh, over the course of the night and where we are tomorrow morning. So stay tuned. All right, so it's nine o'clock on uh, Tuesday. Uh, December 23rd, temperature in the house 50.4, 50, 50 outside temperatures 19.2. The, uh, the maximum temperatures reached uh, outside was 20.7, uh, inside was 53.4. And then we look at our low temperature since last night. We had 12 degrees outside. The coldest got inside the house was 48.7 degrees. Um, coldest temperature reached so far, um, but it's already warming up again this morning. So. I'll shoot that wall, let you see what the uh, window temperature is showing. All right, so 9 o'clock, uh, Tuesday morning, December 23rd. Uh, indoor temperature was uh, 50.4, and the uh, window temperature is still being 56.5 this morning. Uh, that was after a low of 12 degrees last night.